You're watching the Daily Market Comment by Rafi Boyajan. I'm Maria Bashardvis. Thanks for joining us at XM.com. Markets opened in a positive mood on Monday, extending the rebound in risk appetite from late last week. Sentiment was boosted from developments over the weekend that underscored expectations that policymakers around the world are taking action to support their economies. China announced on Saturday a reform to how one of its interest rates, the loan prime rate, LPR, is set. The changes are expected to lead to lower borrowing costs for many small businesses. Further adding to the positive sentiment was confirmation by Germany's finance minister on Sunday that the government is considering increasing spending to support growth, indicating that the size of such a fiscal package could amount to 50 billion euros. Shares surged in China, encouraged by authorities' latest attempt to stimulate the slowing Chinese economy. Stocks in Europe and the United States were also looking on adding to Friday's strong gains. The improved risk-on tone weighed on the traditional safe haven assets. Gold slipped for a second day, while the yen and franc moved broadly lower against other majors. But investors are unlikely to dump their holding of safety assets in big volumes just yet, as many uncertainties remain, particularly over the direction of U.S.-China trade talks. President Trump on Sunday repeated that he's not ready to do a deal with China, linking any progress to how the mass protests in Hong Kong are resolved. There were also conflicting messages regarding the ban on Huawei, as Trump cast doubt on earlier reports that the U.S. will extend some of the exemptions on the company for a further 90 days. The Trump administration is due to announce later on today whether to go ahead with the extension. Should the president decide against an extension, it could jeopardize the planned trade talks in September between U.S. and Chinese negotiators. However, investors chose to focus, at least for now, on the prospect of more monetary and fiscal stimulus around the world, and the U.S. dollar was aiming for a third straight day of gains. The main focus this week will be the Federal Reserve's Jackson Hole event, where Jerome Powell is expected to signal whether or not another rate cut is forthcoming at the September meeting and the pace of easing thereafter. This was today's Daily Market Comment. Thanks for watching at XM.com.